Welcome to Webstar Plus. This is Chat GPT. I'm using GPT-4 model. Chat GPT Plus version. Chat GPT is an advanced AI language model developed by OpenAI, designed to generate human-like text responses in a conversational context. In fact, more than text responses. You can actually talk to it on any subject and get responses that are accurate most of the time. The way you type questions affects its responses. So is there a list of commands that can be used to get proper responses from ChatGPT? How to use ChatGPT properly? In this video, we will look into that. But before that, please give this video a like and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Okay. ChatGPT is quite flexible and can respond to a wide range of prompts. A prompt refers to the text input or message provided by a user, which serves as a starting point for the AI model to generate a contextually relevant and informative response based on its training data and the user's query. You can think of these as suggestions rather than strict commands. ChatGPT can understand a wide range of prompts, but there are few directions to get proper responses. For example, to get definition for words or concepts, use the word define. Define word or concept. Now this is a prompt and it is becoming a skill to learn to use better prompts to get the proper output. This skill is being called as prompt engineering. I guess we will see courses and certificates being offered on prompt engineering as well. But anyways, so define something. Define artificial intelligence. So it provided more than definition. So if this is the definition, how a detailed response will be. To get details on a topic, use the word explain. Explain topic or concept. So let's use explain artificial intelligence this time. So this was explanation. And it is better than definition, right? To compare two or more things, use the word compare. So let's compare Shopify and WordPress. So this was the comparison. But watch this. Give me this comparison in table format. Cool, right? To summarize a link or a text, use the word summarize. So summarize the story of Thirsty Crow. ChatGPT can generate any story. You can give it characters and it will make up stories. Watch this. Give me a kid's story with the characters of a crow, an eagle, and a fish. The clever crow, the proud eagle, and the humble fish. There you go. Give me a kid's story of a dinosaur with 10 eyes and a red mountain. Now this is a random idea. Let's see. Danny the 10-eyed dinosaur and the red mountain mystery.
There you go. And do you know it can invent stuff? Invent totally new three English words and describe them. There you go. Three brand new English words. Fluffer nut rice. Example sentence. When the meeting became too serious, Jane decided to fluffer nut rice the discussion by sharing a funny story from her weekend. Glimmer weight to inspire or energize someone. Square dot. A geometrical pattern or design. Nice. Okay. Summarize. The story of Thirsty Crow. Do you know you can also summarize any website? So summarize apple.com. There you go. So if you want to explore features of any website quickly, use this prompt summarize and then website URL. You can generate essays, stories, reviews, or other formats on any given subject. Prompt can be like this. Write a type of text about any topic and provide details as much as possible. So write a story for kids about honesty and the moral should be honesty is the best policy. The tale of Tommy, the truthful and the golden apple spread far and wide, teaching children everywhere that honesty is indeed the best policy. Okay, you can translate a given text into another language. To do that, Use translate something to another language. Translate hello to French. Bonjour. Translate scientist applied a new technique to French. All right. Okay. Can you respond? in Hindi language. Nice. Can you respond in Urdu language? जी हाँ मैं उर्दू जुबान में भी जवाब दे सकता हूँ पर आए करो अपना सवाल पूछें amazing now you can ask questions and it will respond in the language that you prefer such as okay from now on respond in उर्दू उर्दू लैंग्वेज Jawab Dunga. So ChatGPT is a male. It seems like it's male. All right. All right. Cool. Go back to English language. Okay, you can generate various lists such as top 10 lists, tips, steps, or recommendations by using generate and then type of list. For example, generate names of top 10 breakfast recipes. Okay, you can get suggestions based on your interests or preferences. For that, use suggest. Suggest activity or book or movie. 
सो सजेस्ट ए मूवी लाइक हैरी पॉटर और सजेस्ट थ्री मूवीज लाइक हैरी पॉटर ओके सो द क्रॉनिकल्स ऑफ नारनिया फर्सी जैक्सन एंड द ओलंपियंस द गोल्डन कंपस वेल वेर इज लॉर्ड ऑफ द रिंग्स All right, Lord of Rings is another excellent choice for fans of Harry Potter. Okay, you can get advice or solutions to problems or situations. For that, use word advice. Advice on situation or problem. So, advice on, let's say, broken iPhone screen, and it will suggest the solution. Okay, you can get help with complex math problems as well. To do that, you can use calculate and then math problem. Let's use a simple one, calculate this one. And it will actually give you steps and then result. You can get historical context or information on a specific topic or event. You can ask it like, what is history of? topic or event name like what is history of solar panels well this is a complete history right introduction and then complete history and then summary Okay, you can get a brief overview or introduction to various subjects. You can use prompt like teach me about and then subject name like JavaScript. Well, there you go. JavaScript with examples, with code. You can get guidance on how to perform a specific task or achieve a goal. For that, you can use prompt like how to perform a task or achieve a goal. Like how to learn React.js in 30 days. You have reached the current usage cap for GPT-4. You can continue with the default model now or try again after few hours. Okay, let's use default model. All right. Day one to three, four to seven, eight to 10, and in 30 days. Complete plan, understand the fundamentals, create a basic application, learn about React Router, dive into Redux, build a large application, learn about testing, explore advanced topics, complete a project. Okay, so this is ChatGPT in a nutshell. To use ChatGPT, from your browser, go to chat.openai.com. Here you'll have to log in or sign up. Sign up or log in. You can log in via Google account or Microsoft account or via your email address. Once you're logged in, you will be able to use this chat GPT interface where you will be able to ask any question and it will respond. Remember, these are just examples and chat GPT can understand and respond to a vast array of prompts. Ask any question or provide any input and ChatGPT will respond accordingly. It will also ask more input from you if it needs clarity on a question before answering it. Also, there is no hard and fast rule. Use these prompts, words or type your own question. Just be clear 
and provide as much as information possible in your question. Detailed question will result in proper response. It's kind of a communication. So consider it as a communication and use proper words in questions to get proper answer. All in all, ChatGPT will help you a lot in your assignments, in your work, in your research, in learning things, everything. Okay, I hope it helped. Like, share, subscribe and I will see you in the next video.